We have a warning tonight about credit card fraud. Police say you need to be wary when people are standing too close to you. They're just close to you, period. Kelly, investigators have already talked with several victims. Uh, they have, and police tell me they believe one woman is behind at least four of the crimes. They say she is not acting alone, and tonight they do fear there are more victims. Police say this group at times is actually starting conversations with their victims to distract them. Surveillance video inside the Exton Whole Foods shows a woman sitting at a table with a drink, scrolling on her phone. West Whiteland Township police say one of the people behind her pretends to look at a menu while the other bends down, as if to tie the other person's shoe, and reaches into the woman's purse without her seeing. Seconds later, the second person reaches in. And there's a lot of uh, a lot of effort put into their part to, to steal these credit cards. Police say 33-year-old Jasmine Green and at least two others they have not identified stole credit cards from shoppers throughout. February at three other popular stores, the Giant and the Panera Bread in Exton and the Wegmans in Downingtown. That Wegmans store is where police say Green and another individual stole a 76-year-old woman's wallet. I think it's more sad than anything, although I'm offended that she picked on me. She asked Fox 29 to protect her identity. She says one of the women approached her while her bag was in her cart, asking what healthy foods she should buy her mom, who just had surgery. Which I thought was a little peculiar, but anyway, she seemed very nice. And when I got to the checkout counter, my wallet was gone my wallet with everything in it. Police say Green and others use the cards from at least four victims. That's what police say they are doing here in surveillance video from a Target in Lionville last month. Online court records show Green is out on bail for similar charges in Montgomery County. Through the investigation, we determined she works as a home health care worker of some sort. So, um, which is a, a little scary. The 76-year-old victim says she got all of her money back from the bank and most of her cards. She bought a crossbody purse to keep her cards closer, but says that there's lingering anxiety. Don't be so trusting. <laughs> I hate to say that, but so I was a, a bit wary about leaving the house. But my daughter-in-law said to me, don't let them rob you of your independence. And uh, I took that to heart and um, bravely started leaving the house again. She tells us thieves were actually able to swipe thousands of dollars using her credit card, her debit card rather, that pulled from her savings. So she's warning about that. If you recognize Green or know of the, any other individuals involved in these crimes, please want to hear from you. Thank you, Kelly Rule.